Welcome or welcome back to another video. For those of you who don't know, my name is Kaylee Long and I'm all about the spooky, the funny, and the weird. And today, sorry, I've had a pumpkin spice latte. I got a lot going on. Today, make sure I don't read it wrong, we are going to the Afterlife Beetlejuice The Experience. As you can see, I have on my Beetlejuice shirt and I'm a huge fan of the movie, obviously. Um, I'm wearing this skirt and like tights and boots. I'm trying to look very Lydia-ish. I love Winona. Maybe she'll be there. Probably not. But uh, I'm really excited. I bought these tickets like the day they went on sale, as I've said in previous videos, and the earliest injury time I could get is day three at 12.30. It's 11.25 now, and I have about an hour until I could get in. So I thought we'd go over what the website shows that we might see. I've seen one thing online. It looks pretty cool. I've tried to stay away. I don't, I like fresh experiences. I like experiencing things things firsthand myself. I don't like spoilers, but it, I was just like scrolling and it popped up. I was like, no, get away, no, no, no. But uh, I'd already seen it, so <laughs> I'm not gonna tell you what it is because I want you to experience everything firsthand. But I'm gonna read off what the website says. About the experience, step beyond the screen and into the afterlife where everyone's favorite bio exorcist, Beetlejuice, is dying to see you. For a limited time, grab your afterlife passport and take a seat in the waiting room where you'll be immersed into a strange and unusual world of the recently deceased, filled with ghoulish, interactive entertainment, photo ops, Themed food and drinks that are to die for. Also, side note, I'm gonna do my best to film and show you everything. If they're ever like, you can't film, you can't, I'll tell you about it after. But um, yeah, I paid my ticket. I'm gonna try and film everything. <laughs> we saved you a seat, immersive and interactive, featuring recreated sets, live entertainment, and a cast of electric ghosts and more six feet under surprises. You'll make memories that last at least a lifetime. I love how like, campy this is. Afterlife Diner and Gift Shop. Satisfy your eternal hunger at the Afterlife Diner with some food and drinks. Then grab eye popping exclusive merch in the gift shop. I'm not gonna set a limit for today. If I spend money, I spend money. Okay, great. Nostalgia factor. Venture into the visually iconic world of the afterlife in this all new official interactive experience based on Tim Burton's films. You won't want to miss it. So many are dying to get in. <laughs> Duration, 70 minute experience. Location, Oviation Hollywood Suite 201. And then the rest of the address. Age requirements, all ages are welcome. So I see uh, like time duration and I'm like, okay, does that mean I can't stay longer than 70 minutes or that I have to get there right at 1230 and that's my allotted time and then I get kicked out? I don't know. So that's why I'm gonna get there early because I'm not missing anything. I'm gonna bring my shades because it's sunny outside. I think this is indoors, but let me bring a hat just in case. Recently I went to Spirit Halloween I'm gonna put that video out real soon and <laughs> I got this hat. It says dead inside. I think it's kind of funny. It's very like dad joke vibes. I'm gonna bring this hat. I'm gonna bring this bag. My grandma actually gave me this bag. So thank you, grandma. I love her. I'm putting the hat in here. I have all of my normal essentials when I go out. I've got my extra battery, extra SD card, and an extra band-aid because uh, you never know. I switched my shades because I like these better. They don't have that um that little thing and sometimes it gets caught in my hair and I'm like, ah! Okay, I think I'm ready to go. What time is it? Uh, I was running late. Yeah, I was running a little late, so I got ready later than what I wanted to, but then I got ready so fast that now I'm like, oh, I'm not late anymore. I'm gonna leave here at 11.45, so that gives me 15 minutes to get there, because I live not super close, but not super far away, and I wanna find parking, I wanna walk to this thing, and then I will just stand outside uh, and wait. So I will catch back up with you when I park. Dale, <laughs> Dale, I'm so excited. I'll see you there, bye. Hi, I just parked. Um, I left way early, and I'm glad I I did. Why? Because I don't like to rush. Also, it's 11.58 and my entry time is in 30 minutes, but as I pulled in, there is a beautiful promotional, actually there's a bunch of promotional posters for the movie, and I was like, this is probably gonna be hard to find. Nope, nope. When you have a budget like Beetlejuice, it's not gonna be hard to find. So I parked, I'm gonna go up, I'm gonna film what it's like to get there, where to go, so that when you go, or if you just wanna see what it's like, you'll know exactly where to go and what it's like. Okay, let's go do it. <laughs> I don't know why I did that peace sign. I'm nervous. So this is where the afterlife experience is happening and I already see Winona's little face <laughs> staring at me. Um, they definitely have promotion stuff everywhere and I'm gonna show you all of it.
Okay, I completely walked right past this. Look at how sick. Can I actually take a number? Or or she's just for she's for looks. Okay. Oh that's sick. Cool. <laughs> it drives it on it. Oh. Okay. Um, the juice is loose. This is so fun. So there's already a line. I can't go in for a little bit, but is on level two it's like right next to the tea room so. so it's directly across right over there there's the tea room this is where you can see who won best picture throughout the years so I've still got like 25 minutes to kill um, I'm gonna hope they're gonna let me go in a little early, but uh, I'm just gonna walk around, see what I can see, until it's time to go in. Hi, my ticket is for 12.30, but am I allowed in, or do I have to wait? You have to wait. Okay. We are pretty packed. Should I do like exactly 12.30? I don't know if you could hear that interaction, but I asked if I could get in early, and she was like, no, we have a line, so come back at 12.30, and I'm like, you know what, that's fine. I totally respect it. As long as I don't miss my time slot. That's all I care about.
This is a very serious operation I'm running here, yes? Yes. I'm going to ask you a very serious immigration question. You must answer truthfully and to the best of your abilities, yes? Okay. How old do you think Tom Cruise is? What? How old do you think Tom Cruise is? Uh, 50. Yes, okay. literally no one knows. <laughs> all right, don't touch the ghost, don't steal anything, all right, long. Okay, thanks. All right. <laughs> Come, Mr. Taliban, Taliban. 
Okay, I just walked out. That was an experience for sure. Um, get home and tell you all about it. I couldn't really narrate while I was in there, but just to let you know like all that they had. Yeah, see you at home. <laughs> I'm back so there was a lot going on and I didn't do everything because I've been there for like two hours and the lines were lining and I was like okay I gotta go but you know you first get there you take your pictures you knock on the wall three times like in the the movie and it's like you in, you're entering the afterlife or kind of like the waiting room that they had to go to and you get a passport uh, I'm sure you'll see I I felt a lot of anxiety when I was there but that was just me it wasn't the event it was me I accidentally put <laughs> my last name instead of my first name and she definitely roasted me on that but what's fun is when you're there people have like stamps and you're getting stamps the whole time um i did not collect all the stamps no i did not i did not so all the things that they had they had like a sandworm exhibit which was like a little museum there was someone talking about sandworms there was also a like beauty bar i didn't do that only because like the makeup was a little intense and i have plans tonight and i was like i can't i can't do a green cut crease you know i have to be very demure very mindful for tonight when i go out to dinner um there also was like a subway thing like a not like <laughs> subway but like like a train like an underground train and then there was a map talking about that so i'm sure that will happen there will be something like that in the movie i'm sure there was like a photo booth that you could take to get for your afterlife passport there was a diner and i'll i think i put the menu in here but they had all kinds of stuff i'll read it off to you they had freshly exercised flatbread beetle juicy sliders hot dogs hellfire wings i was thinking about the wings but i think i'm gonna get wings tonight where i'm going so you, you know ghost house guac shrimp for the recently Shh, okay cookies and scream shake afterlife ambrosia shock berry shortcake Cute. I did the, she was like a, a medium. I'm sure that video's in there. It was like heartfelt. I was not expecting that. Cause I, in watching people, a lot of people were laughing. Like I thought it was gonna be super lighthearted, but uh, it, was, it was a little heavy. Like my message, I had the sticks, the cup of sticks. And she was like, do you know if a stick realizes it's a part of a tree when it falls? And I was like, no. She's like, okay, yes, correct. I'm not gonna quiz you. You don't have to, <laughs> you don't have to freak out. But basically my message was that I'm part of something bigger, even if I don't realize it. So I was like, whoa, I, I thought this was gonna be like a ha ha he he, but this was real. They had this like conga line thing. There was a time, oh, I met Beetlejuice. Got a hug with him. There was a very nice lady who like helped me do that. They did some dancing. It was good vibes. There were drinks, but I'm trying to be a little money cautious, especially leading into October, cause I know I'm gonna do a lot. I'm gonna do a lot of spooky things. So it was fun. It was cool. I will be going to see the movie when it comes out. I think it'll be cool. I think it'll be really cool. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button and hit the bell to get notified anytime I post. And I'll see you here next time. As always, stay spooky, my friends. Okay, bye.